Hello, I'm here with a new video for how to manage an inventory. So inventory basically is a very essential part for any manufacturing department on any company who can manage a lots of lots of inventory. Uh, in Flectra inventory can help you to manage your inventory, update your stocks, what is in your stock, how to order a new stock, what is required, it's all are there in the Flectra inventory. So let's just jump to the Flectra and understand the inventory. So this is the Flector database here. You can see uh, lots of module up here. Uh, this is the inventory module. So let's go into that first. So this is uh, the dashboard of uh, the inventory. Uh, let's just understand how to uh, search the product. And if you don't have the product, like how to add the product from your database inventory. So this is the products. So these are all the database we have up here. You can see a lots of stock up here. Uh, you can search it from here. You can search whatever you want uh, in your database. These are the filters which are available for your help. Let's just create a new product. So uh, let's create a pan cap from here. He, here you can add uh, the product image of uh, from your uh, like computer or anything. So you can add it from here. Uh, this is the product type, whether it is a storable product, consumable, or serviceable product. Let's just select the storable product first. What are the sales price? Let's just uh, write it down: ten dollar for a pan cap. Uh, here you can add all other things if you wanted to you, you can add the unit of measures as well if you want it uh, Let's just add in dozens Okay, here you can add the bottle uh, like pan cap variant up here. Let's just add the line uh, Let's just add some color right? White color <clears throat> that Color Add in one new color as well That's the one. All good. Here you can add the sales uh, information if you wanted to. Whether where you can sell this bottle or pen cap, you can just write it down here. This is the point of sale. Uh, this is the purchase model. Uh, uh, we can jump on it later. You can uh, purchase your pen cap from here as well. Uh, this is the inventory like where you can get it what is the weight what is the volume of your product you can write it down everything you can write the description for delivery order as well from here and this is the accounting part let's just save the product first and now it is a sim let's just go to the product database uh, let's search it up here and okay. Uh, you can show into you can see into the database but we don't have in hand right now so first we need to purchase the pen cap uh, let's just go to the flector database first go to the purchase module here you can create or you can order your product if you don't have it or if you want it more Let's just create it first. You can add the vendor name up here. Let's just see a create acquire it. You can like order your deadline from here if you wanted to. If you don't want, that's fine for anyone. Like let's just add the product and cap. Can write it down the description if you wanted to it is a customize how much quantity do you want it so let's just like write it down two two of dozens what is your price you get it so you can get it from final 
so 11.50 is the final price for a purchase let's just save it first here you can like send email uh, to your vendor if you want this is the customizable right like you can write it whatever you want in your terms or in your words uh, this is the PDF which is, a, which is attached you can attach any of the file if you wanted to let's just send it now we need to confirm the order to get the order confirmation so let's just confirm the order here you can see the order is already purchased from here you can download the receipt as well let's just download it this is how you can see it this is everything you have right now let's just go to the inventory again let's go to the product first now let's search it it is not showing up here let's just go to the inventory you can like this area here you can validate your order first you have not recorded the quantity yet so if you want all the quantities you can don't need to write any quantities but if you just wanted the one you can write it up here and just apply it <clears throat> now the order is validated again let's just go to the inventory again product products now you can search it and cap you can see the order is already been purchased now how like if you wanted to sell out your pan cap just go to the sales let's just uh, you can write it down the customer name up here let's just take the zoom interior we need to add the product from here We can write it down the description if you wanted to. These are the blue mark, like watermark. If you write it more than the quantity number, like four, then it shows the rate. It means you don't have the quantity in your hand. So let's let's write it one up here. It's going going to blue again. Okay. So these are the things. Uh, here you also can send a mail to the customer same as the vendor let's just save the product first and confirm the order the order has been purchased by the customer let's just go to the inventory again products products and cap It still shows two of dozens. So let's just go to the inventory again. Delivery orders. You need to validate the order again. Okay, so let's just go to that. These are the pens. You need to validate it. If you don't have any done quantity and if you want everything, just apply it. You're about to confirm the delivery order by text message if you wanted to or if you don't want you can disable the sms as well let's just confirm it go to the inventory again products right and cap you can see the one dozen of the pen cap has been sold out so this is all I have for today. Thank you very much.